but we do want to take you back to North Raleigh because that's where Glenwood Avenue is closed, the eastbound side of Glenwood uh, from Creedmoor Road to 440. So if you need to get to 440 or you need to get to downtown Raleigh, find a different route. I'll find you a route here in just a few minutes, but for now, let's get why this is closed from CBS 17, Shamise Price. Shamise. Yeah, Laura, crews out here still working on that road repairs. They've been working on it due to that water main break that happened um, yesterday. In addition to working on the road, crews also had to deal with a gas leak in this area. Good news there, it has since been fixed, but the road work, that continues here. So the eastbound lanes of Glenwood Avenue are closed between Crabtree, Valley Mall, and I-440 as the work to repair this road is expected to move on to third. Thursday. Now, more than 75,000 cars take this roadway a day, so definitely a major impact to this area. Now, according to Raleigh Water Engineering Manager, the city is spending about $60 million this year alone to try and upgrade the water infrastructure, but this wasn't one of the areas they had targeted for an upgrade because there hadn't been any issues with the line here in the past. Now, crews at the scene found a horizontal crack in the pipe that could indicate this was a weather-related water main break. Getting into what we call main break season, and you have these big swings of temperatures um, from the daytime to the nighttime, and then as we uh, get down below freezing, and then the ground warms back up, the temperature warms back up, you start to see um, more breaks in the system. Yeah, back out here on a Glenwood, you're looking at this heavy machinery out here where you would expect to see cars in this area. And right here in the eastbound lanes is definitely where we see that bumper to bumper traffic as we reach into uh, rush hour. This is something you won't see on this roadway this morning because this stretch of roadway, one of the busiest here in the city, it will remain closed as crews continue to repair this road damage from that water main break. Live in Raleigh, Jamise Price, CBS 17 News.